All right, so let's move on to handling our delete path operation. So I will comment out the SQL code once again, and then we're going to make sure that we pass in the database dependency into our path operation function. And so for our delete operation, what we're going to do is I'm going to do a query. And this query is going to look exactly like this query. So I can actually copy this one in this case. So all we're doing is we're grabbing um, the posts model, and then we're going to filter based off of ID. So we're going to look for the ID of the post that we want to delete. And I'm actually going to remove this first. So I'm going to save the query by itself. And we'll save this as a post underscore query. I'll just save it as post. It's okay. We'll understand that that's a query and not an actual post. And then our if statement to check if there actually is a post with that, what we're going to do is we're going to say if post dot, how do we actually run this query? Well, we do first. So that's going to query it. And so if this returns back nothing, then we're going to raise a 404. So really, we haven't done anything different from what we did here. However, uh, if it does exist, so outside of this if statement, I'll do a post dot delete. And then we'll just say uh, synchronize session equals uh, false. I believe that's the default uh, config anyways. Uh, I don't want to spend too much time going over this. Uh, it doesn't really matter too much, but if you want to read about it, um, just take a look at the documentation. And if you go under, you know, session basics, uh, you could see them kind of describe uh, all of them, but uh, this option is the most efficient and reliable. So I just went ahead with that one and it seems to work just fine. So this is going to delete the post, but remember to actually make changes, we have to do a db.commit. So that'll delete it. And then um, everything else should and can remain the same. I'm going to go back to my Postgres database. We're going to delete a post with the ID of six. So we'll go to our I was Postman. We'll go to our delete operation, and then we'll do a, an ID of six. All right, seems to work, but let's double check with Postgres. All right, and now we can see that there's no longer a post with an ID of six. And then let's test this out with a random post number that doesn't exist. We should get a 404. Perfect. 